Hello everyone, my name is Ankit and welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to show you how you can synchronize all your photos and videos and give them same effect, same color effect and you can post it anywhere, it will look same across all the platforms. The only thing you can do is to create your custom LUT and apply on the photos and the videos and they look similar. So today uh, I'll, I'll show you how you can create your custom LUT and then you can apply those LUTs in Premiere Pro or DaVinci Resolve and Final Cut Pro or any software you want you can apply it. So we'll start with the Lightroom, first we'll edit the photo in the Lightroom and I'll show you how I create a custom LUT and then apply the LUT. Okay, so let's start. So uh, this is the photo, I'm going to uh, reset this photo first. So this is the original photo and you know the concept of the LUT is just to play around with the colors. So here I'm going to play around with the colors only. I'm just going to change the colors in the video, the photo, sorry and then just go to the HSL layer here and just play around the colors yeah I just know so much and then uh, I'm going to the saturation and I'm just changing the saturation I'm just increasing a little orange and let's play with the curve sorry you can you can change uh, in the other software in the Premiere Pro as well but I'm just going to show you you can just also do that just change this a bit this is the picture final edit and now I'm going to export this picture and create a LUT so uh, for creating LUT you're gonna need to go to the website this website I'll mention the link in the description and then you can download this LUT generator for free it's free software and so I've already downloaded it so uh, I'm just going to open this first of all you, we need to generate a hold and then from the hold we will just convert that into the cube so just click on this and then click uh, the place where you want this so uh, I just wanted my this folder and this created this picture so I'm just going to uh, import this picture into the Lightroom. Okay, first of all, I'm going to uh, just copy these settings. Uh, just remember that just change these settings only: white balance, basic tone, tone curve, and the color, treatment color, split toning if you want, lens correction. Just turn it off. The, and the process calibration and this. These are the these are the ticks that you want. Just copy these because we want only the colors import the picture okay so we just copied the setting and we will apply we will just paste the setting onto this picture so this picture we opened it in the Lightroom and we will just paste the setting onto this picture go to the this and right click go to the settings just paste settings so we pasted the exact same settings that we created it you can see that and now export this picture okay just select the resolution as 72 and now I exported the picture you can see that this is the picture we exported and I'm going to uh, open the LUT generator and I'm just going to convert this into a cube file basically the LUT file just open this picture and this will create a LUT file so I'm going to apply this LUT onto the video and you'll see this will show you the exact same effect as photo. So wait for it. So just trying to convert this into a cube file. Okay. The conversion is done. You can see that. So we have created a cube file, basically a LUT file and I'm going to apply the exact same LUT in the Premiere Pro. Okay, so this is the video. I'm going to apply the LUT on this video. To apply that LUT into this video, go to the Effects tab, search here Lumetri, and go to the Lumetri. Just drag this Lumetri onto this. And now go to the Creative section, go to this, select Custom. Okay, apply this cube file, and you will see that it's same exact same as this picture wait uh, okay 
quick selection okay it's the exact same as this picture you can see that it's exactly similar this is a great way for your photos and videos to look same you can see that it's pretty awesome and now you can see the before and after so i'm just going to disable this symmetry and you can see that it's before and after so this is a before and this is after it's pretty amazing and now uh, now you can apply this LUT onto the other videos as well I'm going to show you right now so this is a video and just copy paste this elementary color just copy and paste it here and you can see that it's It's giving same effect. It's it's same. You can go ahead and apply it onto more video. Wait for it. So just paste it here, and again the same. It's same settings. So guys, I hope this tutorial helped you. And also, I'm going to show you if you have the LUT file and you want to apply it on the photo. What you can do, you can go to Photoshop and you can apply that. You can apply on to any video you want. I'm just going to copy paste it here as well. You can see that it's, it's, it's pretty similar. It's the same. It's the same. So this is a great way. Now, uh, I'm also going to tell you if you have the photo and you want to apply the LUT on a photo. So what you can do is uh, you can go to this and uh, you can go to the color lookup in the Photoshop and load 3D LUT is this option. Just click this option and you can apply the same LUT here as well. So this is a great way I guess. See this Lightroom picture, Photoshop picture. And the Adobe Premiere Pro picture profile, it's, it's almost the same. Everywhere it's just the same. And I use this LUTs all the time to synchronize my photos and videos, give them same color effect. And I hope this will help you too. Just try out this. One more thing as, I am, as I'm a LUT creator. So just see that if you like this color grading, I'm, I can make a more tutorial on how I graded this video. Just see that this is an after. And this is a before. So this is a before. And I know that some people might not like this color grading and it's it's totally their perspective and please don't don't judge me it's um, I mean it's up to you some people will like just the original video you know original color grading and this is the raw video and this is this is my grading so it's totally up to you and I hope this tutorial helped you a lot and please suggest me uh, in the comments what to, what topics you want me to cover I'll do that and, and guys please subscribe to my channel it's really important for me uh, you know when I when I see you guys support me it really it really encourages me to make more videos so I hope you do that please uh, subscribe to my channel and thanks a lot bye bye